Writing that equation of an exponential function given two points. First thing you do is set up your system of equations, something in x and y, and leaving the parameters open. A times b to the third power. When you're solving this, in this method, you always want your bigger power on top, so I'm going to take the one, negative 162 and put it on top of my fraction. So then I actually divide these two equations. In linear systems, you could add the equations together, but since we're multiplying, we can divide our equations. So negative 162 divided by negative 2 is 81. A divided by A cancels each other out and turns into a big 1, so I don't have to write it. And then B to the third over B to the negative 1 turns into B to the fourth power, if you remember your exponent rules. So then somehow you have to solve b to the fourth power equals 81. And there are two methods for solving this. You could take the fourth root of both sides and find that in your calculator and you get b to b3. Or you could take, because you're looking, you want you have four multipliers equal 81, you would take this to the one fourth power because you want one out of the four multipliers and do 81 to the fourth power and you also get b equals 3. Once you have b equals 3, you'll take 3 and substitute it back into one of these equations. I like substituting it to the positive exponent equation and solve for your missing parameter. So 3 to the third is 27. So negative 162 equals a times 27. Divide by 27 and you get negative 6 is a. Don't forget at the end to write your final equation, y equals negative 6 times 3 to the x.